Scared out of our collective heads. I'm Patrick. I'm Christian. And we're here to talk about uh, a, a game that a lot of people may have not been able to play. Mm -hmm. It's PT. You may have not been able to play this because Sony decided to pull it down with the whole Konami Hideo Kojima. Yes. But uh, but let's talk about the game itself. Mm -hmm. So so what what did you uh, what did you think of PT? Uh, it's a really excellent horror game uh, for you know for how small and limited it is. Yeah. Um, the fact that you know you're, you're going around doing the loops it, it obviously adds a lot um, to the length of the game. Yes. Um, I will say. Uh, unlocking the final endings, mm -hmm. going through like the rigmarole of like you know all of the different steps that mm -hmm. are completely arbitrary, and you have really no way of knowing what you're supposed yeah. to do. like. Having the mic and having to say uh, like a certain girl's name. I mean, you're saying uh, Jareth. Jareth, yeah, Jareth yeah, yeah. into those the the husband's name. Yeah, yeah. And trying to figure out all these things, somewhat uh, figuring it out through um, a lot of people did it through internet clues. No, uh, yeah. Because yeah. there's there's so much. So basically, the game takes place in in a, a house. You go through two hallways. Mm -hmm. and a bathroom and that's basically it yeah uh, and uh, that's what kind of blew my mind the first time uh, I played it because I knew it was a, a playable teaser that's what PT stands for mm -hmm. and I thought okay well I don't know what this is and I didn't watch any any uh, playthroughs of it and the first time that I went down the stairs opened the door and was back at the beginning yeah yeah it, I, I it, yeah it took me a minute to kind of reorient myself yeah, and figure yeah. out okay what's going on uh -huh. and the game doesn't tell you uh, how any of the controls work yeah uh, it yeah. just kind of throws you in there, so yeah. it's kind of interesting. In it aspect. it, it is, does get really unsettling when you're you're going through the loops and you're starting to see small changes in the hallways, like yes. the, the cockroach that shows up at the very beginning. Yeah. There's a point where the cockroach now has two heads, I believe it is. Yes. Um, the bag, like the the soggy brown bag in the corner of the room, starts to talk to you. Oh, I didn't see that. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. All and uh, from everything that I've seen, I've watched other people play this and seen some people talk about it. Depending on how you, uh, what clues you hit, how you interact with them will show you more of the game. There's uh -huh. different different hidden voices that you may not hear if you don't. There's of course the radio that keeps playing on yeah. the loop. Yeah, yeah. But uh, but you have the, the baby crying, mm -hmm. which the baby reminds me Oh god the baby scene. The baby uh, was messed up. It yeah. reminded me of Eraserhead if you haven't seen Eraserhead. I haven't seen Eraserhead yet. Okay, see yeah. Eraserhead. I've been I've got a long list of stuff I gotta catch up on just because uh, I'm young. Very very surreal. Uh, it's I'll just say it's very surreal but the baby reminds me of Eraserhead. It's uh, David Lynch, right? Yes. Anyway, yeah. Yes. Uh, very weird, artsy, cerebral kind mm -hmm. of stuff. Anyways, so uh, one of the things that I also liked about the game is the the, the kill, the death that mm -hmm. when you get attacked, at least when I did, I got attacked, and then you just start back at the beginning, yeah. and it just keeps it keeps going. I, I'm sure there's more you can unlock. I didn't play uh, too much of it. I know well, the, the very end, if you can unlock everything, uh -huh. is the trailer to Silent Hills. Yes, yes, that's correct. Um, and again, it, again, it goes through like a really long process. It, it's, it's a strange guessing. I don't know how anyone actually figured it out. No um, idea. Yeah, but especially for your average user who just wants to finish the game. Mm -hmm. It takes a lot of the scare out of it when you know you're following like a wiki guy yes. just to get to the ending. Yeah. Um, but before you get to that part when you're just trying to figure it out for yourself yeah. uh, and you're hearing all these different elements, all that are supposed to you know clue you into the next step yeah. and you've got no idea what, how you're actually supposed to respond to it, that is pretty intimidating. I had no idea about microphones or anything like that. So yeah. I would yeah. highly suggest, play uh, if you have a way, Find a way to play this game. Uh, you're gonna have to find a PS4 that still has it on there, but find a, find a way to play the game. Uh, and if you do, play it first blind, and then mm -hmm. try it with a wiki. Do it, just experience it on your own first. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. See you guys later.